What's up everyone, it's Sejo here and welcome to another video tutorial. In this video, I'll be teaching you how to protect a file with password on Windows. Well, what we'll, what we'll be doing in this video is we'll be converting the file which we want to uh, protect with password into the .zip format and we'll be encrypting that zip file with a password and if anyone wants to open that file they need to extract that zip file and in order to extract that zip file they need to enter the password so in such a way we are protecting that file with a password and the user cannot open the file unless and until he enters the password so let's get started so you need to uh, download an application called 7zip to do this so here is the link to download it 7zip.org slash download.html I will leave this link in the, in the description below so go check the description and uh, once you visit this website you will see uh, the latest version of 7zip 16.0 uh, 16.02 uh, is the latest version as of now so you can download this .exe format so it, I recommend you to download the .exe format because it's uh, you know it is the executable uh, format so you can download either the 32 bit or the 64 bit it all depends on the processor which your PC has so I'll be downloading the 64 bit because my PC is a 64 bit based processor so you can just click on the download link here and the download should start automatically and you can see it's of 346 KB well I'm gonna cancel this download now because I've already downloaded the 7-zip application and I've also installed the 7-zip application on my PC so um, once the uh, download is done, just install the 7-zip. You can just follow the on-screen instructions in order to install the 7-zip application. So um, once the download is done, here is how it looks like. So it's a 7-zip file manager and here is how it looks like. Now you can just close this application and let's say this is the file I want to protect with password. So uh, what I'll be doing is I'll be right clicking on this file and in this right click menu you will see an option which says 7-zip once you uh, place your cursor over it you will see another uh, list of options and from this list you got to select uh, extract to uh, sorry uh, add to archive so you got to click on that add to archive and once you click on that a uh, window will pop up on your screen like this and over here you got to give the name of the file or you can even leave that name as empty I mean as default so I'll be leaving this name as default so um, in the archive format make sure that you select zip from this list and uh, over here in the encryption panel you got to enter the password so for example let me uh, set the password as test password and once you have entered your password and you have, once you have selected the format as zip and once you have done giving the name you can just click on the OK button and okay here we go this is the archived zip file um, so here we go this is the zip format and it is encrypted so now you can actually delete the actual file from your PC so this is the actual file hold shift and delete on your keyboard and uh, select yes now the file is deleted and we have with, uh, with us the encrypted .zip file now if the user or if anyone wants to open that file then they got to extract the zip file and in order to extract this zip file they need to enter the exact correct password so let's test it um, in order to extract it just right click and select uh, 7 zip and then select extract to the name of the file uh, just click on that and here we go it asks you for the password now let me enter the password that is test password and click on ok now if the password is correct then it then you will find a folder like this with the name of the file if you open that folder you will see the uh, actual file uh, inside it so this is the actual file inside it and uh, yeah this is the file which I have logged earlier so this is how you can actually protect a path protect a file with a password on Windows it works for all the versions of Windows like Windows 7 or 8 or 8.1 or 10 so that is all I want to teach you in this video tutorial if you have any doubts regarding this video feel free to comment below or even email me at anonymous hacker 156 at the rate gmail.com the email id is in the description below so go check the description for the link to download 7zip and also uh, for links of my facebook page twitter uh, twitter page and uh, my email id and also my website 
hit the subscribe button for more videos. Like my Facebook page at facebook.com slash techgarage156. Follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash techgarage156. Visit my website at techgarage156.com. Thanks for watching. Cheers.